Oh, this is a great stone to pitch him up. There's two balls to go. He scooped it. He scooped it to short fine leg and it catches taken. What a wonderful plan. Head bowed. He goes for naught, not for one. This is intelligent bowling by Ahmed. The fifth ball of the over. Pitch shot. He played it favorite shot. He was a fielder at short fine leg. Went straight to him, Shahzeb. The map. In spite of the fact that two wickets are down, it's 2020. You have to keep a tempo going. A reasonable tempo. Jasuria is just doing that. Razak has to be very careful where he's bowling at this man. It was middle leg, and Sanat Jasuria will punish you there. Yeah, once he is at the crease, he's an ever present danger. Strike rate the other day was maybe around 70 today. So far, it's 212. He's got his revenge. Razak, he was down. But it's Jasuria who is out. A six and a four to start. Jasuria was going well, but he's gone for 17. It's 26 for three. Well, that was a lucky break for Azak and for Pakistan. He charged inside edge onto his stumps and Razak fell on as well. But it was Sanaji. Excellent. Look at that last delivery, so good. Flighted, full, inviting the batsman to drive. Was that deliberate? Almost deliberate. It's for priceless runs at this stage for Sri Lanka. Well, we'll give him the benefit. I think he might just ease this down. Hawkeye, Silver a long way down. Ball drifting in. Yes, it would have gone on to hit. Middle and leg. Very difficult for an umpire. You've got to be guessing slightly. Pulled away, straight to mid-wicket. Yes, gone. It's good again. Every time he bowls, he takes wickets. Pakistan on fire. 14, 67 for five. For Sri Lanka, their skipper, Sangakara, highest score in T20. And typical of the man to get it in a final. And once again, a class player. Deep square leg, wondering if he's going to bounce him again. Sangakara showing him the stumps. Matthews just moved back a little bit just to try and avoid that Yorker length, and he succeeded. What a good execution this is. He's second guess to him, I go, that he's going to bowl Yorkers, and he moves back into his crease. He doesn't move forward, he comes back. Just gives himself a little bit of room to work the ball over the wicket. And here it goes. Danger area. And Chappelle Matthews moving away to the legs to anywhere he wants, anywhere he wants in the third man region. Ball field is just stand and watch it. Now the man goes back. It'll be going the other way around. He's played a good one. This young man is doing a terrific job for Sri Lanka. He's cleared the rope. Well, what a recovery. Then we've talked about 120, we talked about 130, now it's 140. And boy, they'll be competitive with 140. Straight down the ground. Sangakara got off the mark quickly. He's pushing for two. And they're there. He's happy with the young man on strike. He's there. That's a good Yorker. Good comeback. So it's going to be the skipper on strike for the last one. And 140 is definitely on now with a boundary. Keep himself together. Young 17-year-old. They've had a terrific... Sri Lanka are coming back at Pakistan here. There's no fine leg. There's no third man. Cut off so they won't quite get the 140. 
But that's a pretty competitive score from Sri Lanka and a marvellous fight back headed by this. So there we are. Horrible start for Sri Lanka, but... Saida Freedy turned the screw again, one for 20. Ajmal with no wickets, but only went for 28. One over, only from Shoaib Malik, a main man who... Cameron Akmal has had a very good tournament here as keeper and opening batsman. An impactful tournament, so to speak. Shazib Hassan, age 19, has had a couple of... Uh, Moving on quickly. Oh, beautiful timing out of the coaching manual. There for Cameron Akmal, right in the slot. Don't... I didn't give him a price as soon as it went in the air. Matthews charges back. High on the ball, it's high, dives, misses it. He's nearly there. There's no one at fine leg. There's no one anywhere near to it. And it's a little bit lucky for Shazé, but it's four. Always got something new to offer Murali. 65 for two from 10. 74 needed now. Knows uh, he's got the amount of runs required. More than that for the over. Come on! That's well placed by Shoaib Malik. Two taken comfortably. Change of ball in, Udana comes back into the attack. This might be the moment for Pakistan. It's a good Yorker to start, they should look for two here, scramble through and get two. One thing for sure, Shahid Afridi will have a go at this over at Udana. straight down the ground they're looking for two hesitancy and decide just on a single and seven to win Pakistan was he nearly there You're nearly there two overs to go seven required it'll be a great moment back home in Pakistan great performance by the Pakistan side Malinga to continue two overs to go Pretty well at the end of the innings, 138 for six. Pakistan were 63 for two, but what a partnership this has been. So Lassif Malinga, this is his last over. <laughs> Clear play from Afridi, I just sense that he thinks job done. What have you got, Lassif Malinga? Is there a twist? Slow delivery, worked away down the leg side, this runs away quickly for four, and he's got a tickle on it, inside edge, we're nearly there. Pakistan need two runs from ten deliveries. Ground the world champions in T20. Slow delivery down leg side, very comfortably played by Shweb Malik. Very experienced player, he's on 23 of 21. A gem of an innings by Shweb Malik. T20 ICC Championship again, he's out in the West Indies in April 2010. Everybody in, stopping this single. especially everybody must be glued to their televisions tonight one away from the big one the Freedy fittingly hits the winning run Shahid Afridi big man big game it's a leg by who cares